The reason you feel so bad after a breakup is the same reason when some you love dearly dies. Morning, the person may still be alive but the physical connection you had, the special bond between the two of you has died, your body and mind has recognized this the same way as a physical death, you are mourning the death of the love, hopes, dreams and the closeness you have lost. Can you die from a broken heart? Some doctors don't agree it's possible but I'll tell you of the sad passing of Pop, my dad's dad, he was a big man both in stature and presence 6 feet 4 inches tall and solid, his shirts were 19 inches collar but was never able to do the top button up. At family gatherings, find the largest group of people, Pop would always be in the middle of that. After my dad's younger brother was born Pop and their mum divorced and Pop remarried Nanad, a lovely woman, quiet, caring, devoted to Pop and 22 years younger than him. Fast forward 35 years, Pop is diagnosed with cancer in his intestines too far gone to operate with any possibility of success. Less than five days later my auntie went to check on Nanada, walked into the lounge to find her sat in her usual seat, her skin was cold and she had no pulse. The doctor came out and confirmed her death. How does a healthy woman in her mid-fifties, with no record of ill health, no signs of contamination, poison, drugs etc., in her blood? It was a mild July night the previous night ruling out hypothermia but she died. Pop and Nana Dot were never apart except for the years before his retirement Pop worked 7.30 until 5.00 Mon to Friday. He never did overtime or weekend work because he would prefer to be with Nana Dot. When he died we believe Nana Dot felt she had no further reason to live and died of a broken heart. Nana Dot was a Christian and believed they would be reunited after death, she and Pop's lives were so interdependent on each other that she couldn't continue alone without Pop. 